Okay, so now we're back on our client Windows 7 device, but what we've introduced now is um, home network, because in the last example we showed you connecting it straight to the internet, but this is unlikely when you, when you go home, you'll typically have a home router, which will connect you onto the network and will network address translate your home IP to the internet. So what we have now is this NAT machine, and this is doing uh, internet sharing on Windows 7, and that is doing our NATing uh, onto the internet. So this machine has two network cards, one which is local, which is connected to this, and one which connects to the internet, same as you would find on normal um, routes at home. And then what we've done now is we've connected the client onto the home network. So if we go back to the client, you can see now that we're getting a typical 192 address, which um, is on the um, home network. And if you look at the bottom, you can see there's a tunnel adapter for Teredo tunneling. Um, and that Teredo tunneling is, um, Teredo is a tunneling protocol designed to grant IPv6 connectivity to nodes that are located behind a IPv6 unaware NAT device. Um, so what this essentially does is it encapsulates IPv6 packets within an IPv4 UDP datagram that can be routed through the NAT device. So now I'm at home, connected to the home network, and you can see I can still access the same app server that is in my corporate domain and I can also connect to the same file share on the corporate domain. So everything works like it would when I was connected to the directly to the internet. Now I'm connected behind a NATing device and I'm and I can still connect to the same shares. Now the Teredo protocol um, requires specific UDP ports to be open, and this may not always be the case when you're working from home or you're working on a different corporate network, so somewhere where this has been blocked. So what we're going to do now is we're going to simulate um, having those ports blocked. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run a command which will disable the Teredo uh, protocol. So I'm running the command net sh interface to radio set state disabled. And I need to run that as administrator. So now that that's run, if I now run my IP config, you will see that I no longer have the Teredo tunneling pseudo interface. Um, what has happened now is it's fallen back onto a different tunneling adapter, which is the IP HTTPS interface. And that's my IPv6 address over there. So now, I will try and connect to the same resources. And I can connect to my intranet web server. And I can connect to the same intranet share. And there's my shared file. So this is now working over HTTPS.